In this FreeCAD tutorial, you learn how to add this many holes to a tube in the Part Design Workbench. To model the tube, create a new sketch on the XY plane. Select the Circle tool. Click on the origin and drag the mouse. Enter a diameter of 54 mm and press the Enter key to apply. Then draw another circle without dimension. Select the Dimension tool and enter a diameter of 50 mm manually. Sometimes entering a diameter directly results in no circle at all. Click on the Close button to exit the sketch. Now select the Pad feature. Check Symmetric to Plane and enter a distance of 100 mm. The tube is finished. Click on OK to apply. Now create another sketch, but this one will be on the XZ plane. Select the Circle tool and start on the vertical axis. Enter a diameter of 3 mm. Select the Dimension tool. Click on the center point of the circle and drag the mouse to the left or right. Click again and enter a distance of 45 mm. This will be the vertical distance from the origin. Click on the Close button to exit the sketch. Now select the Pocket feature to cut the hole. Select Through All and click on OK to apply. Consider subscribing if you like my content. Thanks. Select the pocket in the tree. Do not select the Polar Pattern tool, but the Multi Transform tool. Then right click here and add a polar pattern. Select the vertical sketch axis. And enter 30 occurrences to create 30 holes. Right-click here again and add a linear pattern. Also select the vertical sketch axis for this pattern. For the mode, select Offset. Enter an offset of 5 mm. You see the pattern cuts in the wrong direction. Check reverse direction to solve this. Then enter 19 occurrences. This may take a while with an older computer. Click on OK to apply. So this is how you can fill a tube with a lot of holes in FreeCAD. Are you also into 3D printing? Then keep watching. You might also want to check out my 3D printing channel. See you there.